This is New Fork River Campground by the BLM. And we are off of US Highway 181 and on about five miles west on uh, 351. And then uh, along the lander cutoff or the California Trail. Now I will warn you, this one's really hard to spot. It's literally at the bridge. And if you come to the bridge, we are just on the bare west side of it. And as you can see, the sign is well off the road where you can't see it hardly. Um, I also recommend you go up this county road here just like a quarter mile. And there is a the new uh, Fork River Park, uh, which is uh, has a really great Emigrants Trail displays and a loop trail if you have time. That's worth checking out. We did. So let's show you the campground. It's not big at all. We'll show you the back end of it first here. That's your vault toilet here. Okay, you can put a tent right there. Okay, here's the bolt ramp. This is all BLM land, so it doesn't matter exactly where you park. Obviously, if you want a little more privacy, I would come back here. Now watch out this road in the wintertime. You do not want to end up in the river. Anyways, and you could camp up here on the on the dike. But there would be a fantastic nice spot that wouldn't have all the mosquitoes. Now this is pretty much the limit of the official campground. So we're just gonna come down. Uh, I went and camped down on the right here, that's swamp. We're driving in a Subaru, so yeah, you wouldn't want to come back here without uh, high clearance here, or higher. That, that would probably be a little less buggy, that area over to the right there. Now to your, to the left here, we're heading kind of towards the road. There's a picnic table. Um, there's someone camped here. I mean, this is court, I'll tell you what, it's more suited to RVs. Um, again, you could put a tent in the middle here, probably. There's the other picnic table. And uh, someone's got probably the only shady spot here. And another boat ramp. Anyways, that really does it for this campground. So I count uh, like three or four spots if you're tending, plenty of room if you're RVing. The vault toilets are old. And if you have high clearance, you could probably get two more sites up there that are a little further away, but less mosquitoes, but also more exposed. So I'm gonna give this one a four, almost a five, but I would say this is a slightly less than average, or it's average, but it's, kind of below average at the same time. Well, this is the Noosa and Evelyn, who's running the camcorder for me today. Thanks for watching. And we are going to get the heck out of here. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Bye.